Hi all, and thanks for watching. This is the second setup video for Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning. And in this video, I'm going to cover upgrading the reshade in the reshade and sweet effects. Now, this is optional as this will actually increase the overall effects, making the game even more vibrant and giving you more of a difference between the default setting and the actual updated setting and depending on where you got it whether you got it at nexus mods or at mod db what you want to do is just look in the descriptions and you'll find the link for the reshade update that you'll need and you'll need 3.41 now with Nexus Mods, same thing, it's in the notes here, and you just use that link. Now, as I said, once you open the link, you're going to just download the 3.41 here. And once you have that downloaded, you want to run that and just minimize your browser. And then you want to select game. Now, if it's not directed to the game here, just copy the game folder name and paste that in here and just hit the enter key and that should put it to the proper files here and you just want to click that reckoning exe set it on direct 3d9 and say yes to overwriting the existing installation and no to adding the reshade shaders once you're done just close that off and start your game you should see the updated reshade now running and you'll have a bar across the top of your game at the game start and you can use the scroll lock in order to enable and disable the effects now I will make an in-game video comparative so that you can actually see the difference between the default and the upgraded version of the effects and I'll just kind of go over the differences that you'll see in the actual settings in the game alright so if there are any questions just let me know in the comments below otherwise thanks a lot for watching take care and I'll talk to you again